Hello, Sudoku friends, and welcome. Today is December 4, 2023, and once again, we are looking at the New York Times Hard Sudoku puzzle. Up today, let's get started right away. I see some fours happening. Four and four here, block up. Four blocks across, four blocks across, so a four must go here. And I see ones. The one blocks down and up and across. Here's a one. I see seven, eight blocking here. So I know that seven and eight must go here or here. The seven blocks, so here's an eight and here's a seven. These must be a three and a nine. We're going to have a seven here or here. And here we are looking for six, nine, and an eight. Nine and six block here, so here's an eight. And here now, a remote pair of nine and six. Um, I just said these are three and nine, didn't I? And these can't be four and five because of this four and five pair. 3, 9 here, 4 and 5 here, therefore 1 and 6 here. That must be right. Now we have a ghost 4 blocking up. We have a 4 blocking across, so here seems to be a 4. 4, 7, 4, 7, 8. 4, 7, 8, 4, 7, 8. We need a 4, 7, and an 8 for these squares. And these must be a 3 and a 9. That's a second pair of 3 9s. We also had 3 and 9s here, didn't we? There's something going on, I think, in the Lover shoot. We remember that this is a 3 or a 9, and we remember that this is a 6 or a 9. We have similar restrictions here, because this square cannot be a 1, 2. It can be a 3, but not a 4, 5. It can be a 6, but not a 7, and not an 8. So this is a 3, 6, 9. This is a 6, 9. This is a 3, 9. We have a 7 blocking down here, and a 7 blocking down here. So we got a 7 here or here. We also need a 7 and an 8 for two of these squares because 7 and 8 block here. We need a 9 here or here because a 9 goes here and here. None of this is a 1, 6. So 7, 8, 9 here. 8 can't go here. It must go here or here. 6. Is this a 7 or what? I think I need to look at that more closely. What can go here? Not a one, two, not a three. We got three locked it down in two of these squares. This can't be a one, two. It cannot be a three, not a four, five, not a six, not an eight, and not a nine. It's a seven. It is a seven. So that gives me a seven here or here. And that gives me, I think, the solution to these two, doesn't it? Because now the three blocks over, this can't be a three. This is three blocks down. So it's clear that one of these must be a three blocking this square, which was a three nine. Now it's a nine. And this is a three. We have a ghost three here. We have this three blocking up and this three blocking over. One of these is going to be a three. So three, six, nine, eight here or here. How much closer to something nice can we get? Well, these must be a nine and a six. We also, by the way, have a one and a six still going on here, just so we don't forget it. So 9 and 6, therefore 2, 5, 3, and a 1 here. That is less than helpful. Let me for a moment return to 
this shoot here is a pretty empty looking, but remember how we said the 478 and the 478 for the 4708 to go here? The operative word here is the 78, because of the four blocks down, this is a 78. Now look at this square. We know that these must be a 78 and a 9. The 9 blocks down, so this is a 78. We now have a 78 here and a 78 here. And that means that a 7 and an 8 can't go here. Let's just focus on the 7 now. The 7 can't go here or here. The seven blocks across, the seven blocks across, so a seven has got to go here. It's not much, but a small victory to logic. Uh, one, two, eight, and a nine across here, two, nine blocks here. This is a one, eight. Remember how we said that we have seven, eight here, therefore this can't be an eight, so it can be a one, but not a two, not a three, four, not a five, not a six, not a seven, not an eight, not a nine. So it's a one. Two, eight, and nine here. Two and eight block here. Here's a nine, therefore a two and an eight here. The nine forces a six to go here, and the nine goes here. We had a 1, 6 here, the 6 blocks down, here's a 1, here's a 6. 1 and 1 block across, 1 blocks up, 1 must go here. These are 4, 5, these must be an 8 and a 2. The 2 blocks over, here's an 8, here's a 2. 8 blocks over, therefore we have an 8 here, here, or here, and therefore this is an 8. It also happens to be the last remaining digit that we needed to find for the row. The 8 blocks down and the 8 blocks down, we finally found ourselves an 8 here, therefore this must be a 7, and this must be a 9. That gives me a 9 up here, and a 9 here or here. These are six and nine stills, and I still can't do anything about them. And these are five and three. Five and three. Can we do something with that? No. I don't think so. We did talk about a seven, eight pair, didn't we? We found the seven. So here's the eight. Which blocks up and the eight blocks over. Here's an eight. A three and a six here now. Six, three. I don't really know much about those. I know that six can't go here. We got three, six, and nine here. So six can't go here either. We need a six either here or, or here. Can we still not do anything here? A two, three, and a five. But we can do something here. A four and a seven. Seven blocks down. Here's a four, here's a seven. At least that is something. Because that was the last seven that we needed for today's grid. We can find an eight, though. The eight blocks down, the eight blocks down, the eight blocks over, and eight has got to go here. For the column, we need to find a one, five, and a six. One, but this is a five, six, we know that. Six, this is a one, five. This is whatever we want it to be, or whatever it is going to be. It's a little unclear, but I think we found our solution to the 9, 3 here now, because 9 blocks here and here, 9 blocks here, and the 9 blocks here. So the 9 goes here, and the 3 finally goes here. That gives us a 3 here, and a 6, 9 here. The 9 blocks down, here's a 6, here is a 9, and therefore we have our 6 up here, and here. And this must be the 3, giving me a 3 here, and a 5 here. And this must be the 9. Up here, we're looking for a 5 and a 2. And we will continue to look for them because I can't 
find them at the moment. This is also a two or a five. So this is not going to be a two or a five. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a three. We'll have to wait and see because we are talking unique rectangle here. And if this is not a two or a five, the only other digit that is available for these squares here is a three. Let's have some fun and not look for those. I think I skated across this a little bit too fast. We were looking for a one, six, and a five, weren't we? We have a six blocking here. We have a six blocking here. So it's clear that this must be a six and these must be a remote one, five pair. And finding this six here and combining it with this six, they are both blocking these three squares and this six blocks here. So here's a six. And now here we're looking for a four, five pair, the four blocks down, giving me a five here and a five here and a four here. Now we have to deal with a missing one, two, and a four, four and four forces a four to go here. The one blocks down, here's a two, here is a one. The one blocks over, the one blocks down, the one blocks down, here's a one. The last number here must be a two, giving me a two here and a two here and a five here. Therefore a five here. And this must be a three, can't be anything else. Three and a five to find. Five blocks up, therefore this is a three and this is a five. I didn't think this was a particularly easy puzzle, but it was a Monday's puzzle. And they tend to be a little harder for some reason, or maybe it's just me. Anyway, thank you for watching and bye for now.